Hello again everyone, thank you for joining us, I hope you're all well. Okay, so we've got $50 left. Um, now I'm not going to buy the bolts yet, it's not worth it. So in the last one, cheers gent, see you later. In the last one we managed to make a pack of french fries, so what we'll do, we'll take that over. Oh, I might as well just walk it over and I, it's only there. Yeah, we'll take this over and put it in the hitbox and then at 12 o'clock we'll, um, yeah, get the cash for it. I think this is 200. So that's what it is on the other game. But obviously I'm on hard mode now. So if it's 200, I've already decided what I'm going to be doing. Um, Because we've got half a tank here. I need to do the jerry can as well, don't I? Well, the fuel can. Right, okay. Oh, come on, Johnny. Yes, yeah, so I hope you're all well. Hope you're all having a good one. Again, no idea what day this is coming out. <laughs> yeah, where you have to um, save this. Um, kind of systematically. Uh... Yeah, I have to record a few in bulk. Um, right. So, we should get our money in just a moment. We should have enough maple syrup to get us back home. We've got three in the cupboard, so that'll be fine. Or maybe two. So, yeah, that'll also be fine. So, let's go over here. And I'll see you just before that money comes in. Okay, so any second now, hopefully we get 200. Come on, excellent. Right, so we'll have a maple syrup now because he's uh, uh, grunting. And let's go and see Mel. Hello, Mel. You all right? Yes, so do we. So, okay, so what I need to do is buy some of this. So we're going to go and start getting uh, Leo uh, ready. So we'll buy three. But also, I don't want him coming back um, without having access to food and water. So we'll buy three of these. And I'll buy a dog food as well. Oh, OK. So we can't yet. Um, we can buy the bowls, I think. Nope. Okay. <laughs> uh, that's a shame. I wanted to get all stocked up first. But that's why. Right. right, see you later, Mel. Um, should we get another harvest basket? Yes, we shall. I'll go and shut, shut the door in a minute. Right. Uh, that doesn't fit in there. Okay, so let's um, shut this. Right, see you later, Mel. And we'll go and find Leo. We've got enough fuel. Yeah. Right, away we go. And what I'll do, I'll leave the treats there as well. So that's what I did in my um, last game. Sorry, mate, we're coming through. Uh... So 163. Can't really be bothered to stop and see Eric. If I've got time on the way back, I'll um I'll do that off camera. Oh come on, car. So slow. Yeah, so the reason why I bought another basket is because obviously in the future we'll need it anyway. But um, I've got a feeling the potatoes fill up 60% of a basket for some reason. 
I've had so many comments, I just can't remember who um, advised me about this. Right, so this is where Leo's at. And um, so there's this sign here. And then there's all these empty packets as well where people are lovely and they've been feeding him. Right. Yeah. So, we'll take this. Leo. Here he comes. <laughs> oh, I thought it was going to be a long time before I saw you again, mate. So, true story, many, many years ago. So, my family are woodcutters. Um, or they were, anyway. And, uh, yeah, many, many years ago, my uncle, he... Um, there you go, mate. He went for a walk in the woods on Christmas Day. And, um, yeah, unfortunately, some arsehole had abandoned a load of puppies in the woods and um yeah so my uncle like my family are all dog lovers well animal lovers actually um yeah my uncle took them all home and i think either four or five of them survived so he kept one he gave one to my other uncle one to my nan and granddad and i can't remember what happened with the rest but yeah they were all rehomed and uh yeah so I, I was too young to remember the other dogs, but um, the one that my nan and granddad had had such a nice life afterwards. So, yeah, she was thoroughly rescued. But, yeah, what arseholes had just abandoned these puppies. They were like, um, they were actually a mix of Alsatian and something else. They were all mongrel. But, yeah, lovely dogs. So, yeah, true story. Right, so what I'll do... Um, I'll quickly stop here and run in and see him. It's pointless, but this will never be using him. Wait. Hello, mate. Vous voulez une érablière à la fine pointe de la technologie? Yeah. Eh bien, Aren't I just? God, I remember all this. I remember how eager I was to get everything. Right. Here. See you later, mate. Yeah, so all of it's pointless to us. What I'll probably do, um, if I get permission, um, when I'm a millionaire on here or something, I'll, um, I'll use the chainsaw or something like that. I don't know. I, I was, um, told that maybe I should uh... how much maple syrup have we got we've got two at home haven't we um, maybe I should just um, use chainsaw to make the uh... garage but I don't want to use it at all I don't want to um, get a challenge and then do it Yeah, different to what was expected oh I didn't leave them there that's why it doesn't matter wait so uh, two o'clock we've got time we might as well run home again and uh yeah see if there's anything to do I wonder if we just lost something I mean we're not far from being able to um buy a back box <laughs> Easy. See, it's crap like that that makes me lose stuff. Being a bad driver. And, uh, yeah. It'll fly in through. But at least we didn't lose that other pack. So from now on, I'll put that kind of stuff in the boot. Only takes a second, doesn't it? But in saying that, the fuel tank had fallen through the boot. Not fuel tank, fuel can.
lovely rain so we don't have to water our plants. Right, lovely. Uh, so we'll take that in. We might use it one day, you never know. Because that will be good to uh, have for emergencies, right? So we've got one left. And how much maple syrup have we got? Yeah, two in there. Nice. Wait, how's this all doing? Eighty-one percent. Uh right, so let's get that other basket out. Pop that there, it can fill up with water. Nice. Right, so I'm going to waste some time and I'll see you in just a moment. Okay, so seeing as it's raining, that's the ideal time to paint a car. So let's just go around and check that everything's... Uh... Nice. Oh no, it's I'm not doing that. Yeah, I wasn't holding that. <laughs> so it probably won't stay white for long. Oh. But, um, yeah, at least it's kind of slightly smarter looking, isn't it? Right, that's the grill. So we need to do that one. And is that everything? Yeah. Nice. So it's slowly getting there. I think this is gloss. Yeah, this is more gloss than that. But we'll sort all that out. Don't you worry. Right. Now it's done. So yeah, the gloss is all over the place, but it's all 255. Nice. Okay. And we might as well head into town now because I can't do anything there and it's going to water itself anyway. Um, we've got maple syrup in the car, just threw some in. So let's go. Nice. And yeah, with the potatoes, if I'm bang on that, that'll mean that... Um, we can start giving money to Roger and doing this car up a bit. So I'll probably go for the exhaust first. Um, and then, yeah, ITVs. I think that's probably the best way, because obviously going for the turbo, the turbo is quite pointless really, if we're just going to be using this for a delivery car. But then I suppose we could do the races. I can't remember how much they are, and I think it's fifty dollars, and then two hundred, and then a thousand, if I remember right. And the races are actually quite easy, quite straightforward. Come on, car, you can do it. Full. Right, so I'll see you all in 40 minutes. Okay, and we might as well buy a poutine and eat it straight away. Yeah. Right, see you in a bit, mate. Take these. Shut that. Oh. And it won't be long before I don't have to do any more of these. Right, let's have some lights on. Oh. Yep, 
Yeah, and one day when I'm doing this pizza delivery, I'll probably find the uh, little packet. Careful of your anxiety. Oh, come on. And I bet someone has already seen where they came out. So I'm recording this on the 12th and uh, yeah, of April. And I almost guarantee some eagle-eyed viewer saw exactly where they came out, but obviously I haven't seen the comment yet. Because, uh, yeah, that episode hasn't even gone live. Right. Cut the corner again. Nice. Okay, so, uh, 16 minutes. So let's go back home now, because there's nothing else I can do here. Um... I think we've got one more poutine left in the fridge. That's all good. Yeah, so the car's looking a lot nicer. Obviously that spoiler looks horrendous. But, um, yeah, I'll get round to it. We should start earning good money soon. Oh, kick down. We need that manual gearbox as well. I might try to set my H shifter up for this game again. I think I tried it before and it caused some issues. So it's not a Logitech H shifter that I've got. It's um, just a generic brand 6 Plus R. And I've got a feeling it wouldn't allow it. I tried it before, but I'll give it a try. Yeah, I didn't recognise it. Right. Were they ready to harvest potatoes? I believe they might have been. Right, turn the lights off. Uh, fuel. Right. So that'll take 15 litres. Oh, jolly, you're such a moron. Come on now. Nice. Okay. I'll leave that there for in the morning. Let's have a little look. 84%. Okay. Not to worry. Right. Uh, it's pointless water in them. Okay, so that does bring us pretty much the end of the episode. Um, yeah. So, thank you for watching, everyone. Really appreciate each and every view. And if you've enjoyed this, please feel free to join us in the next one. Cheers, everyone, and bye for now.